What is up my Squirtalites? It is I, your king, welcoming back to more Let's Play The Last of Us. In the last episode, we made our way through this abandoned, uh, decrepit skyscraper, met a new type of enemy, and got a new weapon, which was nice. And in this episode, we are going to be continuing on through, hopefully not getting ourselves killed in the process. That's really all this is about, is trying to survive. So down we go. Into, I hope not, water. I do not like... Oh, no, there's the water. Never mind, I spoke too soon. Alright. But, don't worry, we don't actually have to go that way necessarily yet. Let's see. Set up through here. Ooh, nice. Corpse. Alright, can we get up here? Yes, we can. Awesome. And this is kind of a confusing area to go through. Alright. Here we go, we're good. What the heck does LLF stand for? I can understand LLC, but I don't understand LLF. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Anyways, actually, we need to go down this way. <clears throat> and right here we got... Looks like a few supplies we can grab. Take those. And down in here, is this a subway station? Fun. Love me a good subway station. Alright, come on. Rick, I'm gonna take this. And what's this? Ho ho ho! We got ourselves a new type of weapon. A Molotov, one of the most useful weapons in this entire game. It can be crafted the exact same way a medkit is crafted, or with the exact same ingredients, anyways. Um, but it is much more vol. I mean, it basically has the opposite effect, though. <laughs> Molotovs can kill you, though, so be careful with them. Let's check out this map real quick. Meet up with second Firefly team at Capitol Building. Capitol Gold Dome. Girl, five foot three, fourteen years old, red hair. They're from the quarantine zone. See, they're not our guys. Nope, not at all. Let's head on through here. We're gonna want to turn our flashlight off. No, no, flashlight off, Joel. Oh God, I'm there. See him. All right. Now I'm gonna show you why Molotovs are so useful in this segment. God, we're almost out. Okay, Joel, you take point. I'll watch the rear. Ellie, no matter what, you stay right on his heels. Sure. You stay sharp. Here we go. I got it. All right, so we want to be very careful here. Yes, I'm, I'm allowed. I, I know how to do stealth, game. Thank you. So let's open this up. Get some ammo real quick. All right. This is what we'll do. I'm going to throw a brick. It's not going to be as loud as I'd like it to be. But it's going to do enough, hopefully. Now, Molotov. Best and most effective way of dealing with clickers. This clicker is going to run right into the fire. And he's going to light himself on fire in the process. There you go. Okay, watch this guy. Oh, God. Oh, oh my God. Test, test, test. Be careful. Okay, well, we took care of the clickers at least. She's down. So the clickers are all dead by one Molotov. That is why it is such a useful weapon. I love it. Oh, God, except for that one. Well, there were four clickers. Wish I'd have known that. Oh well. God, 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 get away from me. Clicker. Oh god, more runners, more runners. Okay, quickly, flashlight on, time to go, time to go. Wait for him. Clicker. Watch the clicker, keep your eye on the clicker. They are not really, it's not really effective to waste ammo on them. Oh god, I missed, I missed, I missed. Alright, there we go. Oh wait, that was a bad throw. Oh, I, I think I got it. No, that didn't do enough. Oh! Nice shooting, Tex. Thanks! Means a lot. Uh, Alright, I think we're good. It's just some health. I'm pretty sure that's all of them. Four clickers. Why were there four? Ugh. I actually got myself killed. Can't believe that. I'm a little bit ashamed of that, honestly. However, over here we got another little thing. I mean, aside from the... Oh, God. 
Oh god, there's there's another runner. I didn't I thought we were done with them. Ah, oh, kill it. Alright, we lost our pipe, that's fine. Uh, right here we got a safe. We need a combination if we want to get into it. So we gotta go look for that combination. It's I actually know exactly where it is. Let me just scour this area, make sure there's nothing else. I'll take this bottle. Very useful for clickers. Alright. I'm gonna run over this way. Just do my hearing again to make sure there's nothing here. Just it looks like that's all of them. Four clickers, four runners. I I think that's all of them. Or was it three runners? I think it might have been just three. Oh well. Anyways, we want to head into this little convenience store here. Grab this stick. In this drawer, got ourselves ammo and a note. Oh no, I did not want to press square. <laughs> now I want to press square. Derek at the bookstore is letting um, Derek at the bookstore is letting us use his safe. When you close tonight, put my stuff in there. Three forty three seventy eight is the combo. So we're gonna want to head back to the safe now that we know the combination. It'll open right up, and we can take whatever is inside. And it's usually some pretty good stuff in these safes. My right, Joel, actually, I think Joel can can calm down. He doesn't need to be running so fast. It's not good for him at his age. Trust me. Okay. Let's see what's in here. So we got, ooh, 50 parts. That is a lot. That is very useful. Glad I grabbed that. Move it, Tess, please. Thanks. And here, looks like it's just a bottle. Make sure there's nothing in like any drawers over here. No, there's health. I think that's everything. You want to be very vigilant and searching for supplies. Oh, f are you kidding me? Okay, hold on a second. All right, this will, I'm, I'm not even going to deal with this this guy. I just want to take care of him. So, here we go. Goodbye. All right, and now uh, we have enough to make a backup, so let's do that. It's, yeah, it's a little nasty, isn't it? Did it leave any ammo for me? It doesn't look like it. All right, so now we're going to want to head up this way. Let's get Tess up there so she can go, drop that ladder down. Awesome. Burn, baby, burn. Hurry up, you two. So there are five clickers in this area. Good God. That's just frightening. Let's make sure there's nothing else over here. Alright, down we go. Holy shit. We actually made it. Well, sorta. Everyone okay? We're not out of the woods yet. Yes. Let's move. Mm-hmm. You guys are pretty good at this stuff. Hey, thanks. It's called luck. And it is gonna run out. Oh, jeez. Joel is not a very optimistic guy. You can tell. Does it look like there's anything. Maybe there is something over this way. No harm in checking, I suppose. Where are we going, Tess? Uh... Capital building in this direction. Okay, let me just make sure there's... Yeah, it's probably over that way. That's where the camera wants me to look, but I'm, I'm checking over here, making sure there's nothing else. Doesn't look like it. I could just jump off the cliff to end this whole ordeal. I'm, I'm sorry, that was awful. All right. We'll find a way in a second. Give me just a moment. All right. Oh, this place looks pretty quaint. Let's go in here. Oh, jeez. Get down. Get down. One. The other ones aren't looking. We're good. Kill it, kill it, kill it. There we go. Stay very quiet. Okay, I'll take this. Why don't you guys screw this up for me? Everything's okay. One more. I'll move that in a second. Oof. I guess that's one way to do it. Step on their head so it explodes. Here we go. They're recently infected. Those soldiers must have just turned. Yeah. Which means there's more in the area. We gotta go. Turn on the flashlight so it just points directly at this box or whatever it is. <laughs> right. Let's use this thing. Let's get up over this. Come on. Climb on up. Here we go. Alright, we have another chain we have to move. Come on. That way. What? I don't hear anything. Okay, 
double time. They're coming. I know. Get it quick. Let's go. Go. On your shoe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a beautiful moment. All right, what do we got in here then? Okay, how do we get out of this place? Let's find out. So we got right here. This is our cra uh, workbench. I wanted to say crafting table. It's a workbench, and we can use it to um, well upgrade our weapons, which I will be using in just a second. I just want to make sure there's no parts around here that I can use. Yeah, I'd sneak out. I'd oh, we're gonna want to listen to this part pretty carefully. You'd sneak out? You know, explore the city. I was in the mall when I ran into infected. That place is completely off limits. How the hell did you get in there? I had my ways. Anyways, one of those, what you guys call runners, bit me. Um, what was that? I see. Were you with Marlene when you were bitten? No. I went to her for help afterwards. Knowing her, I'm surprised she didn't shoot you. She almost did. Hope she's all right. I told you. She's gonna be fine. Yep. We'll be all right. Don't worry about this. She'll be fine. We'll be okay. Everything's K. Let's check in here. Make sure there's nothing we can grab. There's some drawers we can check. Nothing in that one. What this one? Hey, score! Little blade. It's better than nothing. What this door? Hmm. Got another room, hopefully, with some stuff in it. Just like shoot this base. I wonder what happens if I actually shoot it. Let's use the other gun. Just, just one shot. Why not? Yes. Wanted it to explode. I needed the satisfaction of that. Like the pieces flew flew everywhere, man. All right, we can head up that way in just a second. Just being very thorough. Probably more thorough than I need to be. Careful. Sorry, sorry, little Tess. Sorry. Come on, stay close to me. <laughs> she didn't mean to, Joel. It's all right. You need to have more patience, dude. All right. Let's see what's up here. Come on now. No, no, no! Don't fall again. Ah, uh, Joel, please. Let's let's handle nicely. Get there. You go. There you go. All right. Nothing over here. No oh, flashlight. I guess turning it off and on works too. Shit. What? Where is this place? It's an old museum. Some of these things are hundreds of years old. Really? Oh. So there's nothing in here. Thought Joel said he was acting like he saw something. Oh, here we go. Something in here. Blade will take it. Why are there scissors in here? I don't know. In a freaking museum. Are they ancient scissors? Will they really be that reliable as a blade? Watch your head. Sorry. No, no, no. Oh, God. I'm alive. I'll, I'll make my way around. Look, they're here. Yes? Come on. Oh god. Things are getting really hairy really fast. And you know what? We're going to deal with those in the next episode. So with that, guys, this has been the Squirtle King. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Let's Play The Last of Us very much. And I'll see you all in the next one.